In this video, I will tell you how to unlock your phone and to copy the content from an Android phone which has no screen or which has got a broken screen. If the phone has fell down, the screen is broken, then you need to copy the content from your old phone even if you buy the new phone because nowadays the repair cost of the old phones is pretty high. Okay, so this is the reason I have made this video because I had the same issue. So I copy the content from the old phone to the new phone. We have certain conditions, so we will cover those all the conditions. Without further ado, let's roll the intro. Hello guys, this is Pure Up TV. So welcome to my channel again. So today in this video, as I promised, I will be telling you how to unlock your phone if the phone is an Android phone, and the secret behind this is you should your phone should be voice command enabled like most of the android phones they recognize ok google or ok google now or maybe the model version of your phone in my case it is ok moto x this is what i configured so now i will show you the actual mechanism how this works or actual solution for this how this works and we will discuss the rest later okay so you can see how my broken phone actually looks like okay so it is not accepting the command the code which i gave maybe the pronunciation is different so i say a20531 it is not taking that command so what i'll do is i'll just go on google.com and i will just search for the translate english to english i will just put the code here if i put the code without spaces it will not accept that code okay it will say 520,531 something it is not something i'm looking for i need google to say a20531 separately so what i have to do is i have to put the spaces between all the numbers okay if i put the spaces like this a two zero one so now if i play on this button speaker it will say the exact what i am looking for eight two zero five three and exactly the one x is the same number what i want this is what my code is okay so now i will uh, give the voice command to my phone okay so it will uh, recognize my command or it will just uh, try to accept and it will ask what i want to do okay so now i will uh, open this browser which is uh, a browser to show if something open something connects to my laptop because when this phone will okay, be moto x. just show that browser there now i'm giving the command okay, okay moto x. x to my phone it recognizes unlock my phone say, unlock my phone okay so if i give it command because i tried couple of times it was not accepting the commands okay so now when i give 820531 from the laptop maybe it recognizes okay so now in the first attempt it did not recognize the command because the distance between the speaker and the phone microphone maybe was quite large okay maybe they were quietly separated okay this is the reason it has not accepted now what i'll do is i'll just reduce the difference or i'll reduce the distance between both these devices now you see the code given to it just connected it unlocked the phone and you can see this internal storage there on my screen and the pop-up appeared and this is what i was opening the browser for now i can go into the, my laptop uh, and connect to the internal storage of my phone i can uh, copy the content that i'm looking for okay so if i go there inside i can copy all these files whatever i'm looking for just for the one last time you can see the distance between my microphone and the speaker okay this is where i kept my phone so it, it gave the command from the speaker on my laptop and been recognized from my uh, mobile and you can see it is how it worked okay so now for the conditions okay what conditions apply in this case okay if your phone is not voice enabled then you cannot do this okay maybe you need to find some other mechanism okay in my case voice command was never so that luckily worked for me okay and nowadays most of phones they have the sensor like a fingerprint scanner biometric scanners where you touch the phone and you can unlock so in that case you don't need that okay maybe that sensor is broken as well and nothing has been configured then you have no other chance you have no other way to unlock the phone okay. if you like my video just uh, don't forget to like my video share my video and do comment below and don't forget to subscribe my channel unluckily monetization on my channel has been stopped because I did not meet the criteria of having 1000 subscribers and 40,000 of watch time if you watch it just watch it I just increase the watch time and that will help me to put more videos because that will encourage me so thanks for watching subscribe to my channel like my video share my video and do comment below and let me know if you have this thing working for you and if you have any challenges for me that I can cover in next videos sure thank you